Today we'll be completing the breadwinner quest on The Sims Freeplay. If you haven't completed the tutorial yet, you'll need to do that first. You can find the link to that video in the description. The breadwinner quest unlocks the cooking hobby. The cooking hobby is great because you can earn so many LP from it once you complete it for the first time, but I'll explain more about that later. There is no time limit for this quest, so you can take as long as you like completing it. Watch Sim Chef on TV. So this is the first goal. To start this, we're gonna head home and click on the TV. If you go to the first house instead of the second house, you can complete it quicker because the TV in the first house is more expensive and has a higher star rating. Once we're there, we're gonna click on the TV and select the option to watch Sim Chef. This should be the first option that appears on the TV. You'll only get this option when you start this quest. You will not be able to do this until the quest begins and the first goal pops up. Buy a stove. Click on the home store and click on the kitchen tab. There you'll be able to find a stove. I suggest you buy the fire and brim stove one as this costs 350 simoleons. You don't want to be spending all your simoleons to be in with on a high star rated stove. If you want to know more about duplicating items, check out my video on that. The link is in the description. Cook bacon and eggs on a stove. Have your sim click on the stove and select cooking and then select bacon and eggs. This is the start of the cooking hobby, so the more your sim cooks, the higher level they will reach and the more items they'll be able to unlock in the hobby collection. We're going to come back in five minutes when he's finished. And you can see it says 50%. This is how much he's leveled up by in that hobby. And then the bubble will appear above his head with the bacon and eggs in it. Click on this and he will place it on a surface. If there's no room on a surface, he'll place it on the floor. Eat bacon and eggs. So that spatula that appeared is a collectible. You find those every time you cook something. If you find all the collectibles, you will unlock the chopping boards for the first time. After this, you will earn five LP each time you complete the collection. So it's definitely worth it. I'm gonna make Marcus cook again, so we can level up to level two. And I'm going to bring Tara here using the whistle on the sim tracker so she can complete this task. To complete this, your sim needs to click on the bacon and eggs and select the option grab a plate. This takes 10 minutes so we'll be back then. A pop up has appeared to say that Marcus has reached level two in the cooking hobby. Those now available things and coming up next is the collectibles that you will earn in the cooking hobby. So we've unlocked the graters, so he can now find graters. Wash the dishes. Click on a plate and select clean up. She'll then head over to the sink and clean it up. If they can't reach a sink, then they will take it out to the trash can outside. Search bookshelf. To do this, we need to buy a bookshelf. So we're gonna head back to the home store and click on the living room section and find ourselves a bookshelf. I'm going to buy the elegant bookcase, which costs 700 simoleons. This bookcase has two stars, so you'll be able to complete this action quicker than if you used a one star bookcase. Once you have bought the bookcase, Click on it and select the option to search bookcase. This will take 2 hours and 21 minutes using a 2 star bookcase. It does say on the task goal to use your LP. I wouldn't recommend it, you don't need to as there's no time limit for this, so you're in no rush. Whilst Tara is doing that, I'm going to make Marcus grow some watermelons on the garden patch. And I will come back when the task is complete.
buy a toaster. So we're going to go back to the home store, click on the kitchen section and select a toaster. But firstly Tara needs to clean up that plate so I can place the toaster on the surface. The only toaster currently available is the Shocking Toaster which costs 750 simoleons. We're going to place that on the countertop to complete this task. Cook cheese and tomato on toast. Now you've placed the toaster you'll have unlocked this recipe. So click on the stove, select cooking and then select cheese and tomato on toast. This one takes a minute to make. This is the one I use when I'm completing the cooking hobby to earn LP, as you can just do the one minute option over and over again to earn all the collectibles you need. Check out my post, how do I have so many LPs for more information. The link is in the description. Once they've finished cooking, remember to click on the bubble above their head and they will place the plate and complete this task. Eat cheese and tomato toast. Click on the plate and select the option, grab a plate. This will take 10 minutes. I'm gonna to go to Tara's house and she's gonna plant some carrots for a while. This just helps us earn a little bit of money while our other sim is completing the quest task. Invite a sim over. We need to bring Tara to this house, so firstly we need to finish the action she's completing. So we're going to click on Tara's picture and go to her house. She's finished growing the carrots, so we now can go back to Marcus's house by clicking on him on the sim tracker. And then we can call Tara to this house by clicking on the whistle on the sim tracker to bring her here. Cook burgers. This option unlocks once your sim reaches level 2 in the cooking hobby, so make sure you use the same sim that you've been using previously. So Marcus is going to click on the stove, select cooking and then find the burgers. These take 20 minutes to make. So while he is cooking the burgers, Tara is going to grow some corn, as this also takes 20 minutes. I'm just going to get Tara to clean up some of these plates so we can place it on the surface instead of placing them on the floor. Quarter meal. Click on the plate of burgers and select quarter meal. This allows Tara and Marcus to eat the food at the same time. The task completes straight away, but they will still be eating the burgers for 10 minutes. We are going to cancel this action so we can complete the next task, which is rest your eyes on a couch. To cancel an action, click on your sim that's completing the task and it will come up with a bar. The LP button speeds up the task so they will complete the task and earn the XP or other rewards for completing that. We're not going to press that button, we're going to press the red cross button. Then a pop-up will appear that says, you won't earn any XP from cancelling an action. Are you sure you want to cancel this action? So click yes if you do and click no if you don't. So I'm going to click yes and they will stop completing that action. You don't have to cancel them if you don't want to, but I just want to get on and complete this quest. And it's really handy to know for future how to cancel an action. So to rest eyes on a couch, we need to click on the couch and select the option rest eyes which takes 4 minutes 30 seconds. I'm going to cancel Tara's action too and she's going to clear up some of these plates. Once you complete that task the quest is complete. You have now unlocked the cooking hobby so now you can complete the cooking hobby. The first time you complete it you will unlock chopping boards. After that you will earn 5 LP each time. It is my favourite hobby, just because you can earn so many LPs from it really quickly. I recommend you just do the shortest option, which is cheese and tomato on toast, which only takes a minute. You still level up the same as any other option, but it just allows you to complete it a lot quicker. 
And then a pop-up has appeared that says the next quest unlocks at level 7, which is Money Grows on Trees. We're currently on level 6, so once we reach level 7, the pop-up for this quest will appear and we'll be able to start it. Remember you have to complete main quests in order, so you'll only be able to start the Money Grows on Trees one once you have completed the Breadwinner quest. The 2018 walkthrough of this quest will be available very soon. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube to check out these videos as soon as they become available. You can also find all of the quest posts on my website, thegirlwhogames.blog, as well as loads of other information and tricks and tips about The Sims Freeplay. Thanks for watching. Bye.